The main issue with the presentation of this collection is the resolution. If you're a purveyor of crispy pixels, then you'll have noticed that the visuals look a bit fuzzy. The reason for this is that the maximum resolution is 480p. In addition, the screen ratio doesn't match the arcade versions. Side by side, the difference isn't huge, and on their own, the PS2 versions don't look horrible. When overlaid, however, it's obvious how much softer the image is and how much narrower everything looks. This is one of the key areas where I feel there's a strong argument for an updated version of this collection. So, bearing these limitations in mind, what improvements should Capcom make when they inevitably re-release this collection? Well, I think using the fighting collection as a template would be an obvious place to start. As for the games to include, here's my list. Street Fighter Alpha, Street Fighter Zero, Hyper Street Fighter Alpha, Hyper Street Fighter Zero, Street Fighter Alpha 2, Street Fighter Zero 2, Street Fighter Alpha 2 Gold, Street Fighter Zero 2 Alpha, Street Fighter Zero 2 Dash, Street Fighter Alpha 3, Street Fighter Zero 3, Street Fighter Alpha 3 Upper, Street Fighter Zero 3 Upper, Street Fighter Alpha 3 Max, and Street Fighter Zero 3 Double Upper. 